Hi, I'm Drea, and here are some tips to help you cope when times get tough. If you find yourself feeling stressed, uncertain, anxious, or overwhelmed about current events, personal burnout, or academic pressure, remember that you're not alone. As you get adjusted to Bruin life, explore your inner reactions and give yourself a mental check-in once in a while. Try this. Straighten your posture, close your eyes, and take three deep breaths, drawing your focus on your breathing as you do so. Notice any changes? When we're all less physically connected, there are signs of mental health concerns that we can all look out for in ourselves and in our peers. Here's the CDC's official list of the changes you can be aware of. If you notice these changes, it might be time to ask for help. You might be fearful and worried about your own well-being. You might notice changes in your sleeping, eating, or other patterns. Maybe you're having difficulty staying or falling asleep. Maybe you're having difficulty concentrating and focusing. Perhaps you have chronic health problems that are worsening. And if you're increasing your use of alcohol, smoking, vaping, or other substances, that could also be a sign. Now let's talk about the recreational use of drugs and alcohol as a coping device. We do see a few students, particularly at the beginning of the year, pushing themselves to the limit when consuming these substances. You might be tempted to use these things to cope because you think everyone around you is also doing it. But according to a recent study, perception is far from reality. Whether it's alcohol, marijuana, vaping, or other drugs, actual reported use of these substances by our students pale in comparison to the perceived use and frequency by their classmates. I probably don't have to stress this, but substance abuse can cause significant self-harm, especially when taken to an extreme, and that's just not good self-care. By checking in with yourself and knowing the signs, you give yourself a better chance of finding a way to cope that doesn't rely on substance abuse. And if you choose to maintain your resilience by staying sober on this campus, you're definitely not alone. If you have a history of anxiety, depression, trauma, or loneliness, it's good to form an outreach and treatment plan in advance. By working with UCLA mental health professionals ahead of time, we can effectively meet your mental health needs by connecting you to counselors, medication prescriptions, and other helpful resources. Call 310-825-0768 or visit counseling.ucla.edu for more information. And those are my tips for coping through tough times and overcoming adversity. For more information and resources, visit studentaffairs.ucla.edu.